Well, families and students are still rattled over the threat of violence at Brookwood High School this week. Authorities say they now know who left a menacing message along with a bullet in a class, I should say a bathroom. CBS 46's Rebecca Schramm reports school leaders are still stepping up security measures for this weekend's homecoming events. Tonight, Brookwood will host South Forsyth High School for the varsity football homecoming game. Most students told us they felt fine coming back to school today, but they tell us they still have some concerns about their safety during tonight's game and tomorrow night's homecoming dance. Among the students arriving before sunrise at Brookwood High School, Peyton Harley, a senior. I've been talking to some of my other friends. They've been kind of like all bummed out because it seems like they're going to take homecoming a lot more strict than they usually do. And for the football game, apparently like everyone has to be sitting down the entire time. School officials say they've identified the person who wrote a threatening message on a bathroom wall earlier this week and left a bullet standing upright on the back of the toilet. The message said tomorrow during third, I will show all my bullies who I am. After word of the threat spread, a lot of students stayed home during what was supposed to be a fun spirit week. Very unfortunate, very unfortunate. Aya Salama is also a senior. Some people are feeling uh, scared, but a lot of people are still feeling secure. I feel secure. I'm still coming to the game. She says one of her friends, though, is not coming because she's scared. Others aren't convinced authorities have the right person. School officials say they do, but just in case anyone else tries something, they've stepped up security for the homecoming festivities. In a letter to parents, the principal said they're adding extra school resource officers for the game and for Saturday night's dance. They'll have a large presence of administrators and staff on duty as well. Book bags will not be allowed, and they'll enforce the school clear bag policy. It's nice to know that there's going to be like extra people there, but at the same time, it's, it's, it's still a little bit, still makes me a bit nervous. As for the student who authorities believe wrote that message on the bathroom wall, the principal says, quote, appropriate disciplinary action is being taken. In Gwinnett County near Snellville, Rebecca Schramm, CBS 46 News.